Hello, we are back with another example problem of dimensional analysis in this. Okay, so our equivalent statement for this one is we have one yard is equal to 36 inches. Okay, so let me just put it here. And remember, we have to convert this equivalent statement into your conversion factor for it to be useful in this process. So, remember also that the uh, units should always be cancelled. So, what you have here is the given, and what you have, you should write here in your denominator should be the one that can be cancelled. So, we have here 1 yard okay so we have one yard then of course one yard, as we all know, is equal, equal to 36 inches. So let us write 36 inches here. Now remember, it is important that your units should be improperly placed. Because if you reverse it, for example, you place inches here instead of yard, that will bring your answer into the wrong one. Okay? So... We calculate that and this is equal to 1,800 inches. Okay. However, remember, your answer should be properly uh, counted for in its significant figures. We started with 50. Now this here is ambiguous in terms of significant figures. So we have to properly account for. So we must change first or transform this into scientific notation. So 50 yards can be written as 5.0 raised to the power of positive 1 because we move one decimal place. Okay, so in this case, we have two significant figures, so our answer should be reported in two significant figures as well. So we have to convert 1,800 into proper significant figures using scientific notation. So that is equal to 1.8 raised to the power of... So you have to move the decimal place from here, 1, 2, 3 power positive 3 inches okay so that is now our final answer all right so there you have it the final answer now is 1.8 raised to the power of positive 3 so that is from 1800 and we have to do that because you have to make sure that significant figures are correct okay so that is all for this example. I hope you enjoyed it and see you next time.